Hi friends. Today we have an exciting recipe for you. 5 minute sundae. Just what you all need. Ingredients. 10 to 12 strawberries. Half cup almonds. Three scoops of vanilla ice cream and two teaspoons chocolate syrup. Mint leaves are optional. Method Add strawberries and water in a jar and blend it to make a thick strawberry puree. In a glass, layer the strawberry puree, ice cream and chocolate syrup. After layering, sprinkle some almonds on the top. Serve chilled. Enjoy this yummy recipe. Bye. Happy cooking. Hey, I hope you enjoyed watching this recipe from Carrie's Kitchen. Hi friends, today we have an exciting recipe for you. Baked Apple Sundae Just what you all need. Ingredients 1 Apple 2 cups of vanilla ice cream 50 grams raisins And a pinch of cinnamon powder Method Core the apple using apple corer. Take the cored apple and cut it in half. Sprinkle some raisins over the apple. Place the apples on a baking sheet and bake them in the oven for 15 minutes. Remove the baked apple from the oven and sprinkle a pinch of cinnamon over each half. Add a scoop of ice cream on each. You can top your sundae with more raisins, dry nuts or some green apple syrup. Enjoy this yummy recipe. Bye. Happy cooking. Hey, I hope you enjoyed watching this recipe from Carrie's Kitchen. Hi friends, today we have an exciting recipe for you. Baked mushroom and spinach. Just what you all need. Ingredients 2 tablespoon butter 1 cup finely chopped onion 1 cup spinach Pureed, boil and ground. 200 grams mushrooms, sliced thick. 2 tablespoons salt and pepper. 3 cups cheese grated. 2 tomato slices for garnishing. And 1 cup white sauce. 
method melt the butter and add onions and stir fry till they look wet add the mushrooms and continue to stir fry over high heat till vegetables look like they are coated with the butter Take it off the heat and mix in the spinach, salt, pepper and white sauce. Transfer mixture into an oven proof serving dish. Sprinkle the cheese to cover the mixture. Garnish with the tomato slices. Bake in a preheated oven for half an hour or till cheese is slightly brown. Enjoy this yummy recipe! Bye! Happy cooking! Hey! I hope you enjoyed watching this recipe from Gary's Kitchen. Hi friends, today we have an exciting recipe for you, beetroot milkshake, just what you all need, ingredients, 2 beetroots, 2 tablespoons of sugar syrup, 125 ml chilled milk, 1 teaspoon cinnamon powder and 2 scoops of vanilla ice cream Method Boil beetroots with skin on Peel them and cut them into chunks Puree the beetroot in a blender Add sugar syrup Milk, crushed ice, and cinnamon powder. Blend again. Add vanilla ice cream and stir well. Serve chilled. Enjoy this yummy recipe. Bye. Happy cooking. you enjoyed watching this recipe from Gary's Kitchen. Hi friends! Today we have an exciting recipe for you. Bail Just what you all need. Ingredients 3 cups puffed rice Boiled, peeled and chopped 2 medium potatoes Finely chopped 1 large onion Finely chopped 1 large tomato Finely chopped half bunch of coriander leaves. Finely chopped one green chili pepper. One small bowl tamarind chutney. One small bowl mint sauce. One grated raw mango. And sieve and papri to garnish. Method In a large bowl, mix the puffed rice, potatoes, onion, 
tomato. Save. Coriander. And green chilli pepper. Add couple of spoonful of tamarind chutney. Mint sauce. And mix it very well. Now plate the pail. Garnish with some sev, papri. Top it off with some grated raw mango and serve right away. Enjoy this yummy recipe. Bye. Happy cooking. Hey, I hope you enjoyed watching this recipe from Carrie's Kitchen. Hi friends. Today we have an exciting recipe for you. Biscuit fudge. Just what you all need. Ingredients. 250 g plain biscuits. 1 tablespoon toasted coconut powder. 50 g chopped nuts. Two tablespoon cocoa, two tablespoon honey, seventy-five gram butter, and seven gray square tray. Method: Crush the biscuits to a coarse powder. Melt butter, syrup. And cocoa in a saucepan. Add the remaining ingredients and stir well. Set the mixture on a seven-square oil tray or a tin and chill. Cut the fudge into squares and serve. Enjoy this yummy recipe. Bye. Happy cooking! Hey, I hope you enjoyed watching this recipe from Carrie's Kitchen. Hi, friends. Today we have an exciting recipe for you. Crunchy biscuit pudding. Just what you all need. Ingredients: one pack bourbon biscuit, one cup mixed fruit chopped. 100 grams semi-sweetened cream, one tablespoon sugar, one cup water, and grated chocolate or praline. Method: Mix one tablespoon of sugar and two drops of lime to the fruit and keep aside. Prepare sugar syrup by heating sugar and water. Split each biscuit and dip it lightly in sugar syrup just to wet it. Layer it on a dish. Spread fresh cream over it. Sprinkle chopped fruits. Again, spread cream. Decorate with grated chocolate or praline. Refrigerate for 10 to 15 minutes. Your crunchy biscuit pudding is ready to serve. Enjoy this yummy recipe. 
Bye! Happy cooking! Hey! I hope you enjoyed watching this recipe from Carrie's Kitchen. Hi friends! Today we have an exciting recipe for you. Blueberry Pancakes Just what you all need. Ingredients 1 and half cup milk 1 egg 2 drops of vanilla essence 2 cups of self-rising flour 1 teaspoon of baking soda 1 third cup caster sugar 25 grams melted butter and a cup of fresh blueberries Method To prepare the batter, first take a jug and pour half cup of milk in it now break an egg and add it to the milk. Add 1 teaspoon of vanilla essence and whisk the mixture well. Now sift 2 cups of self-rising flour. Add 1 teaspoon of baking soda and 1 third cup of caster sugar. Add the milk and egg mixture to the flour and whisk it slowly until the mixture is combined. Add a cup of fresh blueberries to the mixture. Get an adult to be your assistant. Ask them to heat a large non-stick frying pan on medium flame. Glaze the pan with butter. Fill one fourth cup with batter to make one pancake. on the frying pan and let it cook for 40 seconds and then flip it over with a wooden spatula. Do this till both sides become golden brown in color. Stack on a plate. Add some sugar syrup or some more blueberries if you like. You can also enjoy it with a jam of your choice. Enjoy this yummy recipe! Bye! Happy cooking! you enjoyed watching this recipe from Gary's Kitchen. Hi friends! Today we have an exciting recipe for you. Chapati wrap. Just what you all need. Ingredients 1 chapati half cup cooked beans 2 tablespoon tomato ketchup 2 tablespoon onion chopped 2 tablespoon jalapenos chopped and 2 tablespoon grated cheese. Method On a chapati spread tomato ketchup. 
pile cooked beans on the chapati. Sprinkle the chopped onions, jalapenos and grated cheese. Wrap it and serve immediately. Enjoy this yummy recipe. Bye. Happy cooking. Hey, I hope you enjoyed watching this recipe from Gary's Kitchen. Hi friends, today we have an exciting recipe for you. Choco Hazelnut Sandwich Just what you all need. Ingredients 4 bread slices 2 tablespoon of butter 2 tablespoons of choco hazelnut paste and 1 banana and icing sugar method on a bread apply butter and choco hazelnut paste now add banana slices Toast it and finish with a sprinkle of icing sugar on the top. Enjoy this yummy recipe. Bye. Happy cooking. Hey, I hope you enjoyed watching this recipe from Gary's Kitchen.